DJI Pilot 2 app version 7.1 has been released. The new version not only adjusts the interface of the flight route, but also adds new features such as POI gimbal lock, pinpoint sharing, offline unlocking, and find my drone. After the update, someone told me that they cannot find the mapping and oblique routes. Don't worry, both of them have been integrated into area route. From now on, route types are divided into waypoint, area, and linear, making it clearer to understand for end users. You can select awful or oblique collection based on your needs in the setting page. Awful collection represents mapping as before, while oblique collection is for oblique mission. In the area mission, you can now directly input and adjust the GSD value, and the system will adjust the flight altitude accordingly. For survey users, it's more intuitive. The previous terrain follow feature requires selecting AGL in altitude mode, where you can select DSM or real-time follow. The smart oblique feature is also classified under oblique collection. In the advanced settings of area mission, changing the route start point is now supported. You can set it to another place for more flexible operations. Takeoff speed is also moved into the advanced settings menu. When editing the route, real-time information will be displayed on the left. On the map view, you can now easily search for place and target, allowing you to quickly locate the survey area. A new share icon is added inside the pinpoint information. You can quickly generate a QR code for sharing. Scan the code with your phone to obtain the pinpoint location. We have also optimized the POI feature. If no pinpoint is selected when clicked on the icon, a warning message will pop out. Gimbal lock feature is also supported. During POI, you can lock the gimbal pitch angle with the C2 button and click again to unlock. The album in the home page now supports offline playback. You can view downloaded media files when the aircraft is turned off or switch to another payload. Offline unlocking is now supported. Users can now import unlocking license without internet connection. After the application is approved, the license can be downloaded from the DJI FlySafe website and import through the remote controller. These are the major updates for version 7.1. For more information, you can refer to release note on DJI.com. Thanks for watching.